what is up y'all and welcome to my channel i hope all of my beautiful and my handsome collective out there is doing well so this reading you guys is going to be for anyone of any zodiac sign okay sun moon rising venus it doesn't matter you tune into the right channel to get these messages. So let's see what it is that Spirit wants you to know. Now, if anything resonates, go ahead and like this video. Subscribe to my channel. Also, comment. Let your girl Blue Flame know what's going on. And if you're interested in a personal or anything else that you need to know about me, will be in the description box below. All right, you guys. Let's go. So we have speaker, okay? Some of you guys, your life purpose is going to involve you speaking and your skills or, or, or oration, okay? That talks about your speaking ability here, okay? So something that you could be doing now, something that you could be doing in the, in the future is like you're going to be speaking. Some of you could be holding classes, seminars, okay? But I feel like you're going to get your wings, okay? So I feel like some of you guys, you're practicing now. You know, this could be something that you write, but I feel like this has to do more with you speaking. So some of you guys, you're going to be speakers. You're going to be healers. You're going to be helping people, guiding people on their journey as well, okay? Some of you could be behind some type of podium or, you know, behind some type of stand, but I feel like you're going to have people that's going to be listening to you or watching you, okay? We have go for it. Your prayers and positive expectations have been heard and answered. We've been working with you on this situation since the genesis, since the very beginning, and we will continue to watch over you and everyone involved. Stay on your present path as it as it will take you to a it will take you very far indeed. So I feel like intuitively, some of you guys know that maybe this is your life purpose, or you already know what your life purpose involves. Okay, your spirit guides are saying they've been with you from the very beginning. Before you even knew what your life purpose was, when they knew what you were here to do, they were here guiding you. They're always with you. And spirit is wanting you guys to continue on your path, okay? Continue on your path or get ready to take that leap of faith to start your path. They're going to protect you and everybody else that's involved with this process, okay? So they just want you to stay on this path. Because you will be successful here. But I feel like with this purple, intuitively, you know exactly what this is. All right, we have what do you desire? <clears throat> you now have the opportunity to write the script according to your heart's true desire. Once you clearly decide upon your true desires and you know what you are ready and deserving of them, they're rushing to your life like it's magic. So I feel like some of you guys could be thinking about like what your heart truly desires okay you can be truly desiring to move to another location start a new job start your own career you know a new career love like whatever it is that your heart truly desires okay believe in that shit and then watch it flow into your life like magic here okay all right collective so let's get into this reading let's see what it is that holy spirit wants you guys to know messages for my collective holy spirit what is it that my beautiful and my handsome collective needs to know? Messages for the collective Holy Spirit. What is it that my beautiful and my handsome collective needs to know at this time? All right, y'all. Out the gate, we got, what is this? Obsessed, okay? I think I'm obsessed with you. I think about you all the time, stalk your social medias, and I hope I run into you when I'm out, okay? So someone that you can be dealing with, but I know that you guys are not in communication with this person, okay? Someone here feels like they're obsessed with you because they can't get you off their mind. You know what I'm saying? Like when you think about somebody morning, noon, night, breakfast, snack, you know what I'm saying? When you just constantly got someone on your mind, like that is a little bit obsessed up here, okay? This person is obsessed to the fact that shit, they stalk your social media. Because remember, I said some of you guys could be doing something where you're speaking. You're on some type of platform. You could be doing this now, or this could be something that you're doing in the future. But I feel like this person going to be stalking your ass. 
Okay, for some of you guys, you live in the same city, the same area as your person. They're like, shit, I hope I run into the collective. You know what I'm saying? While we out and about. So someone here, like I said, maybe they know your schedule. They know, you know, on Fridays, you go do your grocery shopping. Or on Wednesdays, you go run your errands. So like this person tries to make themselves available or they try to be out during the time that you out, hoping that they run into you, okay? Tell us more, Holy Spirit. Messages for my collective. What is it that my beautiful and my handsome collective needs to know? So we got somebody here that's obsessed with you, okay? But I feel like this is someone, or some of you guys have someone in your energy that wants you to let them go, though. Okay, so I feel like this person is, is obsessed with you, like borderline stalkerish type shit. But this is someone who wants you to let them go. So this is someone who feels like you've been holding on to them energetically here. This person knows that you deserve good things in the world. And right now, they feel that they're not in the space to give you that type of connection here, okay? Live your life and let me go. So someone here is obsessed with you, okay? They think about you all the time. They stalk on your social media. They hope to run, you know, run into you while you guys are out. But at the same time, you know, this is someone who I feel like even though they're obsessed with you, they feel like they can give you what you need, okay? So this person knows that you deserve more, okay? And they know that that you deserve more and they can give you what you deserve okay but this person wants you to let them go tell us more holy spirit why do they want the collective to let them go for some of you guys they want you to let them go because they are still attached to their ex okay right now for some of you guys they are still attached to their ex emotionally which means they still got love for them feelings and emotions Physically, okay, they still having sex with this person or spiritually, you know, they feel like there's some type of bond between them, okay, and they need time to think and take a break from this connection, okay, so I feel like this person is obsessed with you, they can't get you off, you know what I'm saying, their mind, but at the same time, this is someone who realizes, like, you deserve better than what they know they can offer you, so I'm gonna keep it real with you, Collective, like, for some of you, I know this possibly may have been someone that you was waiting on, but I feel like it's very big of this person to acknowledge that you deserve more and to acknowledge that they're not in the place to where they can give you exactly what you need, okay? So for some of you, this is exactly why this person wants you to let them go. Even though they're obsessed with you, even though this person thinks about you all the time, you know, daydreaming about you at work, at home, like anytime this person has... I, don't even, I ain't even going to say free time. I just feel like you occupy a lot of time in this person's mind. Like, you damn near living rent-free in this person's mind. But this is someone they're still attached to their ex. And this is why this person know, baby, that they can't give you what you need because they're still attached to this person from their past, okay? All right, tell us more, Holy Spirit. Messages for the collective. I love you guys. What's this, why is this person still attached? So what, what's going on in this connection, Holy Spirit? Messages for the collector. Why is this person still attached to their ex? Like, what's going on here? All right, this is someone, I feel like they have figured you out. So you could have been very mysterious to this person, okay? You could have, like, eight house placements that Scorpio placements, okay? Or you can be a Scorpio for my Scorpio channel. What's up, y'all? But this is someone who I feel like they always feel like you're hiding something. I know y'all like, shit, we're not secretive like that. You know what I'm saying? You could be a secretive person, private, but I feel like you just, you know, you keep your business to yourself. Like, you don't want everybody up in your business, okay? This is someone who I feel like in the past, they couldn't seem to figure you out. You were such a mystery to this person. They always felt you was hiding something from them, okay? And this is someone who really doesn't know where they stand. But I feel like this is someone who has figured you out, okay? And the reason why I say they have figured you out, because this is someone who knows that you deserve more than what they can give you at this present moment. You know what I'm saying? So they figured you out. They're like, okay. I can't, you know what I'm saying, the collective needs this, they need loyalty, honesty, truth, you know what I'm saying, they need all this type of shit, but I can't get it to them at this time. So this is someone who I feel like they know exactly where you guys stand, because shit, they're still attached to their ex, they know as long as they're still attached to their ex, like there's nothing going to happen between you and them, that shit is old with, you know? So someone here, they used to feel like you were a mystery, that you was always hiding stuff from them. This could have been someone like maybe you used to talk to them a lot, or you shared a lot of information about them, your personal information. 
But it was like, you know, once you guys possibly separated, you know, you kind of cut that shit off. And it's like this person, they know exactly where you guys stand. They're obsessed with you, but at the same time, Celeste, they need you guys to let them go, okay? So we're going to pull. Let's go to the who that. Let's see who this reading is about. Messages for my collective. I hope you guys enjoyed that reading as much as I enjoyed giving it to you. If anything resonated, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Messages for my collective, Holy Spirit. Who is this reading about for the collective? All right, collective, you can be age 50, 55. Doesn't have to be. This could be you or your person. Messages for the collective, Holy Spirit. Who is this reading about for my collective here? All right, we got age 18, 21. You could be someone or they have freckles. Who is this reading about for the collective here? This could be about an older female. Who is this about, Holy Spirit? And this could be about someone who got a nice ass, okay? <laughs> All right, Holy Spirit, who is this reading about for the collective? Let's get the signs. Who is this reading about? All right, collective, you could be dealing with it. This could be your sign, okay? We got Sag, Leo, Pisces, Aquarius. All right, we got Gemini, Aquarius, Pisces, Leo. And we also have Aries, Pisces, damn, Aries, Pisces, Aquarius, and Scorpio. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.